tree. Old man wins. 001 on the tree. 12th thou above. He's 11th thou behind for the win. Lindsay's 9 on the tree. 6th thou under. Take an 11th thou. You gotta watch how you Brittany Dumonte, 635, 634 in the left lane. Mike Hercheck, 639 in the right. Dumonte, 48 on the tree, but makes it work. Her check's four red. Luigi Greco, 575 in the left. Cameron Atkins, 634 in the right. Both of these guys are extremely talented. This should be a fun race. Luigi makes the 23 light work. He breaks out 2 thou. Cameron Adkins, 12 on the tree, breaks out 14 thou, taking 23. Cameron needs to take 9 thou or less. Jake Mattis dialed 598 in the left lane. John Janu, the third, dialed 647 in the right. Round seven, main event, come on back. We're waiting on you. We got you on a ladder. Twenty-one to nineteen. Mattis, twenty-one on the tree. Ten thou above, twenty thou behind. Janu, nineteen on the tree. Taking twenty, breaking out nine, needed to take eleven thou or less. That ends round two of the 64 car shootout. We're waiting on the round seven of the main event to come to the top of the hill.
American race cars, we design and build the most competitive dragsters on the planet. Founded in 2005, American has quickly become one of the premier chassis builders in sportsman racing. Travis Colangelo and the American team focus on quality, precision, and driver safety. And remember, exceptional customer service comes with every car sold. Round wins, race wins, and championships start here. Join the American family today. For more information, visit AmericanRaceCars.net or see us at the track. even tell you. So we have called round seven, Penske round seven, nine winners to the top of the hill. Once we get them paired up, we'll send them on down.
All right, we have our nine cars remaining in this round of competition, and they are working on the split. So at this time, I think we're going to call the next round. We're going to load the lanes. We should have, how many do we run? We have 32, we've got 16 coming back. All right, so those 16 cars that are coming back, oh, we're supposed to put them on a ladder. Stand by, we'll get you a ladder. Hold on. All right, here we go. This is the seventh round of competition in your vintage trailers. Stainless Works, $30,000 to win. Main event, nine cars remain, and I believe Kirby Mack is on the solo buy shot at nine. So your first pair are going to be Corey Galletti, 437 in the left. Jeff Fenn, who has doubled up to this round, 505 in the door car on the right. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, the last time I saw it, it was on there, but it could be changed. If you look at the back of Chris Galetti's trailer, you know how, like, most people have a minivan. Like, on my minivan, there's a mom, a dad, and a bunch of little kids. On the back of Galetti's pops, his trailer, it says, my kid wrecks $100,000 race cars. What does your kid do? Galetti, did he rack one up, jumped in, and went to the semi or went to the final round of runner up, didn't he? 17 left side, 12 in the right. Oh man, look at that. Jeff Fenn, 12, dead, zero, take nine ten thousandths. That's just straight up mean, brother. All right, we're gonna call our 16 cars back for the shootout into lanes one and two. We're not going the ladder, so your random draw into one and two. 16 cars in the shootout, roll them the one and two. 16 cars in the shootout, roll them the one and two. And we're gonna mix you up potpourri style, which is like a half-baked ladder. If you follow any of that logic, you really should not drive. Carrying on gonna be Matthew Morton and Timothy Irwin. Tim Irwin's 31 up front and out by eight foul. Matthew Morton, 12 at the tree. 36 above, giving the stripe up. It's gonna be Matthew Morton. Again, we need our 16 cars in the shootout. If you're, if you're still alive in the 64 car shootout, you can roll them back to lanes one and two. Roll them back to one and two, it's gonna be random. There will not be a ladder this round. Shootout drivers back to one and two, please. Shootout drivers to one and two. Darren Bylock, 009. Dennis Mead, 027. Darren goes double O, takes double O. Nine at the starting line, takes nine at the finish line. Your winner, three up with a zero, 547. Going to be Darren coming back. Garrett Griffith, 633. Rob Mosier in the right now, 494. Some kind of twisted universe we're living in. These super gas roadsters were picking on everybody all weekend. It's terrible. What kind of nonsense is that? Anyway, 633 for the pickup truck. You know the S10, it's the new first gen Camaro or the old Fox body Mustang. Everybody's got one. How about that? Double O. Mosier kicks it, 493 out tooth thou on the double breakout. Two ten thousandths difference. So Garrett goes 26 thou under, Rob with the winning lap, 24 thou under. 
ten thousandths, two ten thousandths difference. Kirby Mack, just another 420 run. Ain't nobody's business. You really want to get his goal. Mack double at one. Double oh one, dead nine, ten on his bye run. He's down to party at five. He's not here to play, so. Kirby Mack on a mission tonight. Again, one and two. Any of our 64 cars coming back, bring them to one and two drivers. Bring them back to one and two. All right, shoot out drivers in one and two. Please suit up and roll down. Suit up and roll down. Drivers in lanes one and two, we're ready for you. 64 car shootout participants, we are ready for you for this next round. Go ahead, suit up and roll them down. $5,000 on the line to the winner. $500 to Summit Racing Equipment to runner up. There's a $250 gift certificate to Penske if you semi. $250 worth of a Bruzy Racing Transmissions Fluid. And then if you get to the final eight, those that lose at eight, you'll get a $100 Summit gift certificate. So we will start paying next round. So if you win this round, you will have something coming towards you. You want to get through the round of 16, we start paying at eight. So drivers at the head of one and two, please roll them down. Head of one and two, that would be fantastic. This is the last call for ice cream and beer. You can buy one, you can buy the other. If you're really living risky, you can buy them both. So last call for beer and ice cream. I, fe I feel like I'm making an announcement at a fraternity. So last call for beer and ice cream at the beer box. Yeah, just get both. Life is short, man. Ah, you could have, you could have a non-root beer, beer float. I like that idea. Anybody else? I don't know. 
I have to go check. It doesn't matter as long as you can turn on the Yeah, exactly. Right? Like, exactly. That's so why I'm not going to go check. You just redid that to draw the check yep, card. Yep. Who'd you get? Darren Creel. I had five, no four, three, three, Yep. Had, I had no faith. I didn't have a five. <laughs> I'm like, yo. Yeah. We're going to go to the round of 16. This is our 64 car shootout coming to you next. Tisket a tasket, dusk and tasket. That was hard, I gotta work on that. The alliteration gets rough. Tackett in the right lane down 480 and the dragster backing up. This is round number three of our 64 car elite shootout. Logan Back, the owner, operator, developer of the Go Dead On app. CEO, marketing director, head janitor, bottle washer, president, Man, you should see him file a complaint against HR. It looks odd. 631 on the left. Again, go dead on app. You got to check it out for all your electronic racing data logging information. They have that premier version. Has weather, uh, ET predictor, all kinds of cool stuff. I think it has the scan feature. Scan it, download it. You don't even have to type it in anymore. Tackett has gone deep here multiple times. 478 on that 480 sends him to the round of eight. Billy back. Dialed four and a quarter. Brett McRae. 641 on the right. We need all of our drivers back. All of our drivers back for our 64 car shootout. Roll them into one and two. Roll them into one and two. If you guys stack them up, we're going to have to send you front to back. We should only have 16 to go. seven up front to be 16 at 16 that's a good spot to be buyback Billy no buybacks tonight Lou Greco the golden voice in the GTO helping out a tremendous amount not with entertaining on Thursday night with a live band but also being here in the tower helping to cover we really appreciate all that Lou Greco does He's taking on Justin Logan. Logan leaving first out 627. Greco looks for a 575. Two foul separate him. Anyone's raised topside charge. Right lane, 627 with a nine, dead on. Greco takes nine foul, goes 17, 10 foul under. He needed to take 007 and some change or less. So seven foul would have been the magic number. Lou Greco done at 16. Justin Logan advances to the round of eight.
Carl Kyle, left side in the dragster, 468. Rich Payton in the right on a 609. of 14. Kyle, 11 up front, take double 05, one above three. The effort in the drags are good enough to get to eight. Brittany Dumont, 633. Nick Shade in the right on a 628. Double 04 up front, double 03 at the stripe to be one above three. Your winning lap, Nick Shade. Next, you've got Carson Neely and Jake Matus. Mattis or Matus? Jake from State Farm. 599 in the right, Carson Neely, 627 in the left. Yeah, right. Jake from State Farm. It would be absolutely hilarious if he jumped out in a pair of khakis and a red polo and be yeah. like, what the heck? Yeah. That'll be his winner circle picture. Oh, man. Eight, ten, foul, two red. If he would have worked with Allstate, he would have been in good hands. 625 on the break <laughs> on the breakout for Car Oh god, I gotta get my stuff together. Carson Neely, your winner. Doesn't matter. Poor Jake. 008, triple 08 red. Next up, Ryan Sparks, 444 in the left. Ryan actually is just driving the pants off of that car. He can't change the dial. I think it's been there for three days. Steve Butler, 468 in the right. There were some very fast cars on property this weekend. We saw 14s. 23-45, Ryan Sparks can't give him that kind of daylight. Sparks able to take 19, running one above nine. We've seen as low as 14 and as slow as 740. Pretty big spread. Steve leads 452. Chuck Griffith, thank you to Chuck and Chuck's Auto Body for helping bring the Motormania TV live coverage to the World Wide Web at no cost. Thanks to Chuck and our good friends, the Davises, over at Fleet Doctor. Unfortunately, we saw Chuck was lined up way left of the groove, and it uh, it didn't pay out. He gets the win. Get out of here, ladies and gentlemen. Never say never to the pudgy announcer sings, because Chuck Griffith just pulled one out. All right, so if we're taking up a collection, we're going to send Chuck up to the street to get some scratch-off lottery tickets. If anybody wants to get in a piece of that action, bring your hundo to the tower. When Chuck wins tonight, we're going to send him down to the either Piggly Wiggly or Corner Mart 7-Eleven, and we're going to play Ohio's Powerball. Poor Chuck.
Welding, pumps, regulators, filters, fueling champions. Uh, owner of American Race Cars and uh, been building cars since I was a uh, long time. And uh, started American in 2004. We built a little over 800 race cars. That's just dragsters plus store cars and all the other stuff we built. Roadsters, juniors, and uh, fixed a lot of cars, worked on a lot of cars. Travis, yeah. what do you do here in town? So we get raw tubing aids. Bend it, cope it, notch it, weld it. We build a complete car from scratch. Everything on here is ours. All the tabs, the brackets are ours. Laser cut, done. We build the bodies, the dashes, the, the nose, seats, molds, everything. We assemble them, wire them. So when they leave here, they're complete. So we, we put in a lot of transmission that has all your parts in it. Everything that you guys do is in that. So I thought it was a good thing to get married up so we can put it all together. Transtech is inside of here. Almost all of these. I would be shocked if it wasn't. All our seals, outside yeah, of it's, yeah, I mean, gaskets, pan gaskets, uh, ceiling rings. I can almost guarantee that's ours right there too. One thing I can say about. Travis and American race cars, even when you're at the racetrack, you're you're helping everybody. Yeah. You're not just worried about you, you're not worried about... We don't just build them, we actually race them too, so yeah. we're at the track, we support everybody, every brand, we do everything we can to make sure everybody's good at the races. So part of our partnership with American race cars is, is these track packs that they will have in stock in their trailers and are available to anybody that might need help. That maybe Travis, you know, you have a leaky pan gasket or a leaky input or output uh, seal, you will have them available. So, Transtech helped us out last year at our ace race. Uh, we've been doing it for five, six years now. Six years. And uh, we put on two great races a year. This year we're doing three. So, we do two at Dragway 42, one in Columbus, and Transtech has stepped up and really helped us out with our program there at Case Ohio events. We're actually doing a contest where we're giving away electric bike through Transtech. Stop by our trailer, there's a sign up code, a QR code that you can scan and get entered in that, or you can follow us on social media. Both Transtech and American Race Cars will have both the sign up sheets on that to so see if you can get involved in that.
All right, to our 64 car shootout drivers that remain, there should be eight of you. We need our eight drivers to make their way to the rear of staging to see Travis for pairing. We have eight cars remaining in the shootout. We need those eight cars back to the lanes for pairing. Round eight, brought to us by House of Pain Performance. Five cars remain. Your first pair of cars for round number eight, brought to us by House of Pain. 544 on the dial in in the left. Darren Krelak, Jeff Fenn in the right, down 505. Fenn is 17. 17 up front, one above one for the win. Jeff Fenn headed to three cars. Next pair, Matthew Morton, dial 582. Kirby Mack, dial 426. Kirby has been absolutely on a terror today. And this is it here, he's 20. Double O eight, dead on four, taking double O six at the stripe will be Matthew Morton. Twelve total. Take double O six. Kirby was twenty up front and out by nineteen ten thousandths and could not get there. So Rob Mosier will be the buy run this round. Right, so we've got Matt Morton with a 008. Yeah, 008. Jeff Fenn with 17, and Rob Mosier has had a buy. Is Matthew...
So it looks like Matthew Morton will have a bye at three cars. Jeff Fenn will have lane choice over Rob Mosier. So it will be Jeff Fenn with lane choice versus Rob Mosier and Matthew Morton on the bye run. At this time, we need all eight, all eight of our shootout cars. You may be at the top of the hill. And I our shootout drivers are ready as soon as our shootout drivers are at the head of stage and suited up we'll roll them down and run our round of eight if you lose in this round of eight you have a $100 summit gift certificate coming to you round of eight you have a if you lose this round you have a $100 summit gift certificate coming to you I'll put your name on the top of it and then we'll run them down to the ace trailer for prize awards Again, if you lose at this round of the shootout, you'll earn yourself a $100 Summit Racing gift certificate.
Nick Day left side dialed, 628. Chuck Griffith, Chuck's auto body in the right dialed, 624. This is your quarterfinal round of your 64 car elite shootout. No time run, no buyback. Nick Day, double O three. Turning it on to go dead four. Seven total for Nick. Chuck was 30 off the tree and that was it. Carl Kyle and Ryan Sparks. Carl Kyle, patiently, sitting and waiting side by side with Ryan Sparks. Double O six red for Kyle, winning lap, Ryan Sparks. Double O two out by double O two. Ryan Sparks, moving on to the semi. Your next pair in the 64 car shootout. Carson Neely, the Camaro left side, down six and a quarter. Dustin Tackett, the drags from the right, on a 479. Wow. Trip zips red for Tackett. Carson Neely, your winner. Neely runs down dead zero. 625 and a 625. Your final pair at the round of eight, trying to get to that semifinal round. Justin Logan down 628 in the left. Billy back at a four and a quarter in the right. Identical reaction times winning lap, Justin Logan. He goes dead two, taking double 08 Logan for the win. Billy back, 426, one above one. Again, Justin Logan headed to the semis.
American race cars, we design and build the most competitive dragsters on the planet. Founded in 2005, American has quickly become one of the premier chassis builders in sportsman racing. Travis Colangelo and the American team focus on quality, precision, and driver safety. And remember, exceptional customer service comes with every car sold. Round wins, race wins, and championships start here. Join the American family today. For more information, visit AmericanRaceCars.net or see us at the track. So we're going to go to our semifinal. We have the semifinal of the Vintage Trailers Stainless Works $30,000 to win main event. Three cars remain. We have a semi-final round of our 64 car shootout. Four cars remain. In that shootout, Ryan Sparks will have lane choice over Justin Logan, and Nick Shadi has lane choice over Carson Neely. So obviously, as soon as our two remaining main event cars can come to the stage and lanes, we'll be set and ready to run that semi-final. And then as soon as our four drivers in the 64 car shootout have an opportunity to cool the fuel their vehicles and then make their way back up, we'll be set and ready to run that semifinal as well.
Ben Mosier goes five thou red. Jeff then heads to the final round with an 18 green lap. That was the competition side of the semifinal. Mosier was dialed 494, but goes 5 thou red at three. Jeff Fenn heads to the final round here tonight. Race cars, we design and build the most competitive dragsters on the planet. Founded in 2005, American has quickly become one of the premier chassis builders in sportsman racing. Travis Colangelo and the American team focus on quality, precision, and driver safety. And remember, exceptional customer service comes with every car sold. Round wins, race wins, and championships start here. Join the American family today. For more information, visit AmericanRaceCars.net or see us at the track. We'll have Lane Choice versus Justin Logan. Nick Shadi will have Lane Choice over Carson Neely. We're looking for you to the lanes paired up, and we're ready to send you when you're ready to go. Right, we need James Edwards of 889 Raymond Street, apartment B in Akron. James, James Edward Kuhn. Looks like James Edward Kuhn. Nah, I won't give out any more details. James Edward Kuhn, we need you to the tower. Matthew Morton on the solo shot. The semifinalist headed to the big dance. Goes 25, one above zero. So Matt Morton will take on Jeff Fenn in the final. Jeff has lane choice, so it'll be Jeff Fenn versus Matthew Morton for the $30,000 to win top prize here tonight. Brought to you in part by Vintage Trailers, Stainless Works, Summit Racing Equipment, and the family and team at Ace Ohio Events.
regulators, filters, fueling champions. We are ready for our semifinal of the 64 car shootout here in the tower and at the starting line. We're looking for our four drivers to make their way to the head of lanes one and two at this time. We are looking for our semifinalists for the 64 car shootout to the lanes.
here comes your semi-final round of our 64 car shootout. Nick Shade, 627 in the left. Carson Neely, 625 in the right. Equitably paired. And one dragster remains. Only one. Carson Neely will send Nick Shade to the final round with a 628 lap, one above zero. 18 up front. But Nick Shade headed to the final round with a shot at $5,000 cash. Question is, will Nick be running up against Justin Logan dialed an identical 627 plus or minus a number? Or Ryan Sparks in the dragster dialed 442 in the right? Oh, identical at the tree. It's anybody's race. Logan or Sparks, it's going to be the dragster. 002 margin of victory at the finish line, 19. Take double O2 to be one above two. Justin Logan was 19, one above four. Your winner, Ryan Sparks, will go to the final. Nick, you will have lane choice in the final round. So Nick will have lane choice over Ryan in the final of our 64 car $5,000 bonus shootout. We are looking for our final round participants in the Vintage Trailers $30,000 main event presented by Stainless Works where we will see Jeff Fenn with lane choice.
versus Matthew Morton. Our 64 car shootout final will be Nick today versus Ryan Sparks. Nick, you'll have lane choice over Ryan. American Race Cars, we design and build the most competitive dragsters on the planet. Founded in 2005, American has quickly become one of the premier chassis builders in sportsman racing. Travis Colangelo and the American team focus on quality, precision, and driver safety. And remember, exceptional customer service comes with every car sold. Round wins, race wins, and championships start here. Join the American family today. For more information, visit AmericanRaceCars.net or see us at the track.
Knock, knock. Who's there? Big money. This is your final of the $30,000 to win. Summit Racing Equipment, Ace Ohio Events, Vintage Trailer Stainless Works, 30K Saturday night main event. That's a big mouthful, almost as big as their paycheck's going to be. Matthew Morton, left side on a 581. Jeff Fenn, 505. Both of these drivers have clawed their way past 400 alternate competitors to get to this single pass tonight. $30,000 on the twin 30s on the line. Clean and green, 3,000 separate them. Morton out in front, but the wind light falls to a dead on eight lap for Jeff Fenn. 21 up front, dead eight, taking double 09. Jeff Fenn, your winner here this evening. Matthew Morton, your runner up. Congratulations to both teams. We have one more final to go, and we're looking for Nick and Ryan in our 64 car ultimate $5,000 shootout. But tonight, Jeff Fenn is the champion of the $30,000 vintage trailer stainless works Saturday night main event.